In this video, we'll find the oxidation numbers for each element in NH4OH. That's ammonium hydroxide. So ammonium hydroxide, this compound here is neutral. There's no plus or minus after it, so it's a neutral compound. That means all the oxidation numbers, they're going to add up to zero. So that's important. Next, if we have ions, we have our ammonium ion here and our hydroxide ion here. They're ionically bonded together. But when we have ions, all the oxidation numbers are going to add up to the charge on the ion. And we can look that up if we don't have it memorized. NH4, that's the ammonium ion. That entire ion has a charge of 1 plus. So the oxidation number, that's going to be plus 1. And that's for the whole NH4 ion. The hydroxide, we look that up, it has a charge of 1 minus. So the oxidation number for the entire hydroxide ion, that's going to be minus 1. And we can see these oxidation numbers, they add up to zero because it's a neutral compound. So that's useful information. Let's move these up here a bit and then figure out the oxidation numbers for each individual element here in NH4OH. Let's start with just the NH4 ion. Let's look at the ammonium ion first. So we don't know what nitrogen is. That's not in our rules. We're going to just call it X. Hydrogen, when it's bonded to nonmetals, that's a plus one. So each one of these four hydrogens has an oxidation number of plus one. And the whole NH4 ion, the whole ammonium ion, its overall charge is one plus. So the oxidation number is plus one. Let's do a little equation, see how this works. X is the nitrogen, since we don't know that, plus we have four hydrogen atoms. Each one is plus one. And that equals the oxidation number for the whole ion which is plus one. So put a plus one here. X plus four equals one. Subtract four from each side. X equals a minus three. That's the oxidation number on the nitrogen here. So let's clean this up a little bit and write in minus three as the oxidation number on this nitrogen here. Next, let's take a look at the hydroxide ion. We said the overall oxidation number on the ion, that equals the charge. So our overall oxidation number is minus one. Oxygen, that's going to have an oxidation number minus 2 with just a few exceptions. Put a minus 2 in here. Hydrogen, when it's bonded to nonmetals, oxygen, that's a nonmetal, plus 1. And the entire hydroxide ion has an oxidation number of minus 1. They add up to minus 1. And in this case, that makes sense. Minus 2 plus 1, that gives us a minus 1. So those are the correct oxidation numbers there for the oxygen and the hydrogen. And these are the oxidation numbers for each element in NH4. OH, ammonium hydroxide. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.